Hey guys, welcome back in. My name is Dan C. Bearded. My subscribers call me the trusted teacher for all things beard related. And this is my favorite series, the Carrier Oils 101 series, where I break down the ingredients that you are putting on your face in your beard products. And we are gonna cover metal foam seed oil. And I'm gonna tell you why this has one of the most unique histories, one of the coolest origin stories, and some of the most unique benefits. And in the end, I will tell you if I recommend it for your beard and highlight a couple companies that I know that are using this and encourage you to enlighten me on others that I forgot or that I missed with this ingredient. So if you like this kind of content, I promise you'll enjoy this video. I love nerding out on beard ingredients and the science behind it. And if that's something you're into, I do encourage you to subscribe to the channel and give back by giving a little thumbs up to show that you enjoyed the video. So sit back, relax, and get your learn on. Where? Well, this ingredient comes from the seeds of the metal foam flower, and this is, yeah, actually a flower that is native to the U.S. state of Oregon, but has since spread throughout the Pacific Northwest in U.S. and Canada. Now, I see my boy Emo over there smiling, representing for us. Yes, 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 sir, this is by you. And it gets its scientific name from the meaning marsh flower because it does really well in poorly drained soil, and it gets its nickname, the metal foam flower, because it's a white flower. Flower, and when you look out at a meadow of these, it looks like it is just foam out there, which is kind of cool. History. My favorite segment because I am an actual history teacher of 10 years, and this one is really cool. It is the most recent oil that I've covered in any of these series, and it is the very first oil that was studied because of its chemical potential rather than its history. Now, what do I mean by that? Some of these oils that I've looked into and covered have been used for 10,000 years by different people throughout history, and then modern scientists are like, hey, They've used this, there must be a reason, let's see why it works that way. This is the opposite. No one had used this oil before, and people said, hmm, there might be some potential in that, let's go check it out and see if it can be used for people. And this all really came about in the 1950s when the USDA put out some money out there for research to find a new renewable oil, and people started to look into the metal foam flower and the seeds of that flower to see what it could do, and it was the Oregon State University that really led the way and carrying forward the state of Oregon was the first state to have people commercially plant and grow the meadow foam flower and it has some challenges though there's some good and there's some bad the bad is it is bee pollinated so it is really tough to really control it on like a human level and another tough thing is the meadow foam flower is white it is not as attractive to these bees so it can be inconsistent with its yields from the crops or from the flowers and another thing that is really Really good though is because this is such a new technology and such a new oil we can almost guarantee all of the suppliers of this oil are going with the cold pressed method no chemicals nothing that's going to take away from the value and that is awesome to know that pretty much if you're buying this it's going to be quality because there's only so many people that are making it and then selling it benefits Metal foam seed oil has a lot of benefits, but I'm going to start out by saying it is the greatest teammate of all time in the beard game. And what do I mean by that? Well, teammates do their job, but they also make others better. And this is one of the only ingredients I know that truly makes the other ingredients better. First off, it is an extremely stable oil. It has a very long shelf life, one of the longest I've ever studied, but not only that, it increases the shelf life of that entire product. It makes the other ingredients last longer just simply by being there. It is a very powerful antioxidant, so it'll prevent that product from going rancid and then expiring too soon, truly making its teammates better. It is also odorless. There are some great oils out there, but they stink. They have wonderful benefits, but if you remove the smell, you remove some of those benefits, this one is odor free. It also is very light in color. Some people don't like yellow or darker colored oils. 
You don't have to worry about that with this ingredient here. And this oil, the metal foam seed oil, mimics our sebum oil very closely. That is the oil we naturally produce on our skin, and we are lacking that once we get our beards. That's where the itching comes in. That's why your beard dries out. We're just not producing enough sebum oil, and it does a wonderful job of trying to duplicate or replicate that, very similar to a jojoba, as if it's kind of a waxy type oil. So this will give a little bit of thickness to your product without being sticky like something like castor oil. So many awesome benefits there. But damn, that, that's all great. I like that it works together, makes it, but is it good for our skin? Is it good for our hair? Yes. It is 90 to 95% fatty acids. That's wonderful. There are all these different chains of fatty acids, but to just sum it up and give you just a, an easy explanation, we want fatty acids. Those are really good. They work for us. It is an emollient and is going to nourish our skin and hair in a great way. And it's one of the best ingredients at trapping fragrances. So for those of you that like a long lasting fragrance, Metal Foam Seed Oil is proven to hold on to fragrance better than almost all of these oils that we are looking at and using in these beard products. So benefits, huh, I would say so. Do I recommend Metal Foam Seed Oil in your beard products? Well, I'm gonna make a bold statement right now. This oil is in my top three carrier oils. Yes, top three carrier oils. It is one of the absolute best. Made in America, cold pressed, all natural, one of the best teammates of all time, mimics the oil that we are naturally missing where we need it. Yes, truly, truly wonderful ingredient. I went through every bottle of beard oil. Well, company it kind of sums it up. If I have 10 of one company, I only got to look at one. I went through every company's bottle of beard oil that I currently have in my house, and I only found two companies that were using this, and I really hope this video will shed some light and increase the number of companies that are using this oil. The two that I found that are using it, uh, the first one that I've been using since the very beginning of my beard journey is the Bearded Bastard. The, the premium, I believe this is the more expensive line of theirs, has the metal foam seed oil in it. And then also one of my most addicting, one of my most used companies and newer to me would be Whiskey and Hardtack uses metal foam seed oil. And I believe for Whiskey and Hardtack, it's their second most potent oil in this bottle. So if you've tried Whiskey and Hardtack, you've tried the Bearded Bastard and you love their feeling beard like I do, two of the absolute best then this may be an oil for you to keep an eye out and look for. But a challenge for you guys, what other companies are using this oil that I didn't know about or that I missed? I would really like to know that. You guys always enlighten me on some that I just don't follow or that I haven't tried, and that's really cool to hear. So please, if you have any questions on this carrier oil, put it down below in the comments. I would love to help you out. If you have anything to add to it, feel free. And I hope you guys enjoyed this content. I always say it, but it's true. These videos don't get the most views, but I enjoy them. They will be here forever. And if you made it to the end, man, thank you. Dancy bearded. I hope that you guys stay bearded and stay positive.